The most important thing was the result. What was your overall verdict of the performance? I'm frustrated at the minute, but I've, I've even had just five minutes to think about it now, and I think we've played very well already. You know, I mean, I don't, it, it's frustrating because we should have scored a lot of goals, um, of course it is. And it probably did get, it probably got flat in the second half because we didn't take the chances, and I think there was just a frustration. You know, the crowd went quiet, um, and it got to the players. I think they felt the sort of the quietness. You know, be like or just that sort of. Oh, you know, we're not getting the goals, but um, but I not overall. Listen, the game was never in doubt. It, it really wasn't. Um, so credit to the players, professional performance. And obviously, we just found out we won't have a game next week. So um, I'm going to have to try and organise something because we don't want it to become bitty in terms of competitive action. Yeah, I guess you've been desperate to play next week. Ah, yeah. I mean, off the back of yeah, this, you know, you, you want to go and play another home game against a team that are flying, but. You know, it's added a game to their calendar, but it's, um, you know, we should have, we should have probably the game. You know, couldn't be. I'm sure would have, wouldn't have wanted an extra game, but you know, fair play to Broxburn, I think it was. So we'll just, you know, we'll take the games as they come. And uh, and I think Albion drew as well. So and in as well. So I mean, there's been a few draws, and I did say to the boys before the game that somebody would go out today. You know, to a, a lesser team if you like. You know, I don't think there's such a thing, but a team of in a, le- a lesser league or a lower league, but. Um, We've made sure it was nails today, so we're happy with that. Yeah, the early goal was really important, wasn't it? Aye, the early goal was, you know, it was important and it was good. It was good play. I thought both goals were high quality, um, and then the, the wastefulness after that or in between that. So, um, aye, no, Sean Heaver, you know, three goals and two, three, three starts. So tremendous, you know, delighted for him and, and he deserves that, it's his first taste of the big Scottish Cup if you like, so I'm delighted that he gets his goals. Yeah, and it could have been half a dozen by the end of the game, couldn't it? I think so, I think so, with the greatest respect, you know, but as I say, they made it difficult for us, they hung in there and it, it made it nervous for the last ten minutes, you know, because if they get a goal, which they were sort of working towards, you know, they were, they were getting a wee bit of momentum going, so, but we've seen it off, we did enough to see off, but... Listen, we're delighted to be in the hat, so let's see what tomorrow brings. Yeah, who, anybody you would fancy in the draw, particularly? <laughs> I would like a home tie, obviously. It would be nice to have a winnable tie to get to the other side of Christmas. You know, they're all winnable, obviously, but, you know, something realistic for us at this minute. Um, so we'll just wait and see. You know, uh, a derby would be nice again, you know, for a couple of them this year. So they're always good games. Cup games bring their own wee bit of flavour. So, um, but we'll wait and see what it brings. Yeah, you'd hope that Josh Peters and Dylan Bikey might have been available today. Any update on how they're doing? Um, no, no, it's uh, just Josh is one of these injuries that just seems to be lingering on a wee bit. And, uh, so we'll, we'll wait and see how Josh reacts over the next week or so. It's been disappointing. The good thing we know game next week potentially gives these players that extra. So we'll go and we'll, we'll try and you know get them ready for that. Um, Dylan is he's close. You know, we'll be hoping to get him into training this week, so hopefully again, you know, by the time our next game rolls around, wherever that may be at this minute, hopefully, we'll, at least I know we're ready, Josh, we'll, we'll wait and see for the minute. And would your preference be to play Cowden Beath as soon as possible after the postponed day? <laughs> Aye, you know, we want to play with games, particularly at home, we'd have a opportunity to get three home games in a row there, you know, and it's, it's sort of emptied that, so, but, but what we'll do is, you know, we'll, we'll come in hard this week, we'll work, um, and, we'll, and we'll just get it as if there is a game. You know, we might, we might be able to organise something. You know, behind closed doors or something like that. So um, certainly, we'll be a wasted Saturday. We'll be in working, and uh, certainly maybe let's Martin and I get eyes on teams within the league as well. So presents a wee opportunity for different things on a Saturday, and not three points, unfortunately. Good stuff.